And now I'm going to show the last thing that I wanted to show today is uh, what we're calling borders. Now, if we go to our shot layer properties, we have a new option here called border. So in the past, what I have done to make a border is I have added a, a solid color layer behind my video source and I've I've aligned it just right and made it you know a pixel or two bigger than my video source and created a border like that now all you have to do is add width to your border i have the option of making it uh, appear inner like inner inside the frame of the source centered on the frame of the source or outside the frame of the source um, i can obviously change the width of that i can change the color Let's make that a pretty green color. <laughs> uh, and then I can also change my corner radius. So with this, you can add a really nice looking um, like rounded corner. And, and it works after crop too. So you can see I'm cropping my, my source here. So there we have it. You have you now have borders. Uh, one other thing you can do here, which is a little bit unrelated to borders, but or the adding a border is you can feather. So I can add a corner radius and feather. Make this a nice little vignette look here. So that is really exciting too, because it saves a ton of time. Our buddy Wilton in the, the YouTube or the Facebook comments is ecstatic about the borders. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Wilton. Good to hear. Good to hear you like that. So we have a lot of new features in 15.2. It's not just those three. Um, those are the three probably most high profile ones because they were all very highly requested features. Um, but we've, again, uh, you know, we've been, been working on this since the summer, so we've got a ton of bug fixes. It's really, we're, we're just nailing down all of the stability stuff. And uh, now we're starting to get down some of these long requested features as well. So we're really excited about 15 too.